Great, thank you. Welcome back, everybody. I hope you've been safe. Thank you for all your past support. All right, we're gonna do an airliner video today. All the airliners in the sky getting tagged by UAP Dragons. Uh, again, I've mentioned this before. Uh, there are very few UFO reports by airline pilots, but here's one of them. China Airline, November, um, November 14, 2020, 147 Los Angeles time. He reported when he was over Culver City, California. You're going to hear Culver City, California a lot. Over that airspace at 8,000 feet, he saw a UA, UAP, a UFO, and reported it to the uh, government, FAA. Um, kind of hard to find the story, but it's there. The reason I'm revisiting this is I, I have all those airline videos. And let's go to the next. I'll show you. Okay, here we go. So here we go. We got an interpolation. We actually, by some coincidence, this is a China airline flying right over Cobra City. So I know when to turn my camera on. I deliberately wait uh, five seconds until he's over the airspace and I turned it on and look what I found. January 26th this, this year. Got tagged by two dragons. I interpolated the video. And look at this. It's, it's astonishing. This is where the uh, FAA took the uh, UFO report, right there over Culver City. Um, very easy to do, and since Culver City's in the middle of West LA, you could record these jet airliners anywhere in the city. So that's like a, uh, that's like a 30 mile square, uh, a lot of square miles. So it doesn't matter where you are in West LA, just turn your camera on and zoom in. This is the runway from the north. The runway from the east, I'm sure would work, there's just no reason for me to drive that way and record jets when I could do it from my balcony. All right, let's go to the next uh, video. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to show you some airliner videos just for this month only. I'm going to try to show you as many as possible. I'm going to try to talk fast here. So, all in the month of September. Look at this. All, it's the same format. You, uh, you just look at plane finder when you see the jets coming or you just look out up at the sky. When you, and when you see the bigger jets, I like to record the bigger jets. It's just easier and you get better video. So here we go, you just, again, it's an easy format. Uh, just leave your camera on and review the tape later. You can't, you don't see them in real time. They're invisible to the human eye, invisible if you have binoculars, but a digital camera will. Look at this, we'll see these dragons. Uh, you run through the contrast, reverse on it. It's a lot easier, a lot easier. Sometimes it's the only way to see them. Um, and you can do a screenshot. I'd advise you if you start recording airliners, do a screenshot of Plane Finder. Just makes it more professional. It explains what's going on. Um, but uh, yeah, this is so you'll see a lot more airliner videos. But uh, I'll show you whatever a few more, and then I'll save the best one for last. Okay, and the last uh, photo, the interpolation. Uh, yeah, this is from a new viewer, Mike in uh, St. Louis. Uh, he's very uh, curious about what's going on here, so he's turning his camera on. He just turned on his cell phone. He started re uh, recording these airplanes. He lives next to an airport, and he's been scoring close to 100%. I mean, I don't know what's going on in St. Louis and all these dragons. I told him to go buy a lotto ticket because this is unheard of. Um, but yeah, he sent me the video. I interpolated it. So anyone in the anyone could do this in America or in the world or you can come to Marina Del Rey and do this uh, and go to Culver City and turn your camera on over it's it's ubiquitous what can I say all right thank you for watching I appreciate it please remember to like subscribe comment I, I really need your support uh, thank you very much I'll see you in the next video Bye.